Aviation is more than a sport. And it's more than just a job. Aviation is pure passion and desire which fill a lifetime. For some, this passion and desire has led them here to Metropolitan State University of Denver's Aviation and Aerospace Degree Program, New Student Orientation. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the uh, Aviation New Student Orientation. We are the only department in the college that does an NSO for our students. The NSO stands for New Student Orientation. It's sort of an inside abbreviation for the Department of Aviation and Aerospace Sciences freshman orientation activity. We started NSO in 2001 as a way to really get them put on the right foot and, and get them going the right direction. Make sure that they have the information they need to have to be a successful student in the aviation and aerospace program. Students in a very, very relaxed uh, and non-challenging atmosphere have the freedom to um, network with um, industry contacts. They can get to know faculty on a personal basis before they even get started with the semester and talk about mutual interest. They can talk to potential employers. When I look back and see some of the employees that, that we now have today in key positions who were once interns many, many, many years ago, those are the type of people that we want to hire and bring into the Jeppesen Company, the Boeing Company. Uh, we have Dave Ulane here today, who is the director of the Division of Aeronautics for the state of Colorado. Uh, Dave has a long career, both in airport management, uh, a little bit on the flying side, and now he's a director of the state for the Division of Aeronautics. So to be able to see some of these industry leaders coming right from MSU Denver is just extraordinary for the students. Metropolitan State University, we have a very, very integra uh, integrated and very aggressive internship program especially for our aviation and aerospace folks. I'm a product of an internship program and it's a huge passion of mine because it's a great opportunity for somebody to learn about a particular field of work and one of our, our legislative mandates is that we will promote aviation education in Colorado and, and just one way we do that is through supporting internships at Colorado airports where folks like me and, and indeed four of the eight of us on our staff were interns at one point in time at a Colorado airport. The program's over 40 years old and it encompasses really four major areas. Uh, the pilot side, aviation and aerospace management, air traffic control, and aerospace operations, which is both the space commercialization industry and the unmanned aerial vehicle industry. So those are the four cornerstones of the program, the four areas of degrees uh, that you can get through MSU Denver. A lot of people don't realize that Metro State has been in existence now for 50 years. Uh, we are located right on the Auraria campus, which is actually the geographic location where the town of Auraria started right before the town of Denver started. So we're historically very centrally located to the main city of, of Denver. Our department is um, one of the finest um, aviation programs in the country, and I think um, what makes us unique is our flexibility and our economy. I mean, we, we, we are economical. The most important thing to know is that our industry is very professional and we expect students to have a professional attitude uh, coming into the program and that means being engaged, being self-responsible. Make being a student your job for the next four or five years that you're going to be at MSU Denver. Focus on the task at hand. Focus on that day. Be successful that day. I'm really excited that everybody's here. It's a really exciting time to be a pilot uh, or anything in this industry. Like getting slapped by the universe. And it's just like, what are you doing with your life? Why are you doing this? The one thing that you'll find in aviation that I've certainly found through my 30 years in the industry is the passion that is inherent in just about everybody that does this job. It starts very early. Today, we are talking about going to Mars. We're talking about doing asteroid retrieval with ion-generated motors and engines. The first concept that you absolutely need to engage in in order to succeed is the concept of pilot and command. 